I'm Randy Picht with the Reynolds Journalism Institute. In December 2020, RJI teamed with the National Association of Broadcasters and research firm Smith Geiger to conduct a national survey about the vaccine rollout. In this video, we're going to talk about the important question of who you should consider interviewing about the vaccine. To assist me, I'm joined by Monique Luisi, a professor and researcher at the Missouri School of Journalism who helped on this project. Hi, Monique. Hi, Randy. Monique, tell us about the results. So we asked our respondents who they would want to see interviewed. And the results bared out pretty convincingly that they want to hear from experts over pundits. We included options in the survey, such as doctors and nurses, local government agencies, um, or uh, higher level government agencies like the CDC or NIH, personalities, and also social media. And overwhelmingly, people said that they would be most convinced by hearing from a doctor or nurse or from government agencies, local health officials, and um, also a pharmacist. Less convincing was social media. So in the end, people want to hear the facts and the news from the experts, and they don't want to see as much, nearly as much, um, the opinions from social media. Thank you, Monique. You can find these results and more online in the vaccine rollout kit that was put together by NAB. Thanks for watching.